Kaylin Patterson, Midwest Muscle. We're here at MBS Fitness with Kimmy Arnone. And I'll let this man introduce himself because he's got a big show coming up in two weeks. I think it's two weeks, two yeah. Weeks. And uh, Brian is going to introduce himself and give you a little history because he's new to me, I'm sure. And I'm sure he's pretty new to the, the Midwest as a whole. So, Brian, would you care to introduce yourself? Kaylin, appreciate that. And Kimmy, thank you. Absolutely. I'm Brian McCabe, I'm running the uh, Illinois State and the uh, North American Natural April and July uh, INBA shows. I'm uh, new to the INBA myself. I won my pro card last year at Team USA. Mm -hmm. uh, I'll be looking to make my pro debut at the World Cup November 1st this year. Uh, but the two shows behind me are the, the main focal point right now. And I've been lucky enough to reunite with the queen here. <laughs> And uh, Kimmy has been running the last five years, so we're gonna, you know, partner up and and uh, with Kaylin and the rest of the Midwest All Stars to try to, you know, keep building an empire here and uh, give the Midwest what we deserve. There's a lot of competitors here that yeah. need a lot of shows lot out of here that don't need to travel. Uh, they're all natural shows, so we're all here very passionate about it. And my team that I have behind the scenes as well with Body Sculpt and, and promoters or uh, sponsors. Um, yeah, we're, it's a uh, it's a powerhouse family, you know, yeah. and we're looking to keep building things year by year and make it the best out here and crush the West Coast and the East Coast, really. <laughs> <laughs> Represent. <laughs> now, you know, when we're having shows of, of, of this caliber with, with these kind of organization names, it, it's got to be a good feeling to be a part of it and know that, you, you know, there for this region, there has been a deficit of shows as compared two competitors that want to compete because we're traveling you know I compete so I, I travel you know hundreds of miles to compete at, at different shows when it should be with Chicago it's so hard to fathom that we don't have more shows in this region and nothing against the other organization nothing against the other shows it's just that if we have this many competitors in this region it should be a better demand to have better shows in this area. I completely agree. Yeah, 100%, and that's the full focal point. Uh, the key thing is going to be I including you guys into the ingredient mix, mm -hmm. you know, and spreading the word. Uh, from there, it's all going to come from the the consistency of the shows. You know, Kimmy ran outstanding shows, uh, and, and the biggest focal point is for the competitors. Mm -hmm. You know, it's like you, you, you want to have a good experience. You don't want to be rushed and thrown around and and wrestled through like a cattle call. You yeah. know, you want to have proper yeah. time. You, you want to be on stage when you're supposed to be on stage, not 30 minutes late, not 30 minutes early. Mm -hmm. You know, I mean, we want to make sure that all that runs smooth and I'm going to do everything I can. Diet is real big for natural competitors. Diet is real big and feed time. time. Yeah, time mm -hmm. and then, well, you know, you can be. Absolutely. Yes. There's nothing worse than pumping up and waiting 30 minutes, you know I mean? <laughs> We're going to look to put a halt to all that. We're going to have a good time. I got a lot of backstage help. Um, it's just going to run real smooth. And uh, where's the venue? Guerin Prep, Guerin College Prep High School um, out on River Grove. River Grove, yes. Belmont Avenue. Belmont Avenue, River Grove. Grove. No, it's only about 10 minutes from the gym. Um, it's pretty much at Belmont and Cumberland. Mm -hmm. It's right on the border of River Grove in Chicago, so it's a great area. There's lots of places to eat. The host hotel I know that you picked is really close, which is great for our athletes. Yes, comfort um, suites there. Yeah, so um, I'm just excited that you're taking over and you've got the same mentality and athlete drive and um, taking fancy, care of these. Yeah, yeah taking care Appreciate of these competitors yeah. the same way that I did for so many years. Um, so I'm excited that you're taking over the reins. I uh, appreciate there. it. I'm very excited and happy for you. Uh, thank you. It means a lot. And really the best, you know, the more people I meet, the judges that have gotten involved, you guys, um, mm -hmm. there's been so much more passion that I've found for an overview of a sport as opposed to other leagues where it's more centered on that person. Yeah. You know, it's all about that person competing and getting in other people's heads so that they mess up. Yeah. Where what I found more in the INBA and with you guys, there's really just a consistent theme of everybody looking to help everybody. Yeah. You know, it's, and it's everybody's really here to support camp. everybody. It really and it, is it's, that's the biggest camp. thing I found with the, the natural leagues. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, mainly INBA, yeah. and you know, I, it's I look at crossing over and meeting people, OCB, DFAC, all them things that are around. Mm -hmm. um, you know, we want to partner up with everybody. You know, yeah. it's all we're all here in the Midwest to compete. to compete. We want to compete. Want to compete. We don't want to go anywhere. <laughs> 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 we want to well, stay yeah, home. Family, you know. Yeah, you know, people want to come and watch. Yeah. You know, it's it's hard yeah. when you travel 
you know, to go do a show. So I appreciate everything you're doing and uh, bringing me into the mix. Kimmy? <laughs> <laughs> We're going to help keep the standard high. Absolutely. You know, yeah. And um, we look, you know, look forward to more future things, yeah. obviously. Yeah. Well, go ahead, Kimmy. All right. One of the biggest things I want to say is um, through meeting Brian today, um, he has such a passion as an athlete himself um, and respect for competitors because he's been there, he's done it. Um, so for that, as an athlete myself and as someone who has always represented the best interest of the athlete yeah. beyond anything, um, I'm just so appreciative that this is now your baby. And I know just from talking to you today um, that he's going to run it with his heart the same way I did for so long. Um, so I just hope that people come out and support him the same way they did support me and support the previous shows that I put on. Um, because he's got the same passion and drive and I, I'm just excited to be there and see it and watch it all unfold and, and this is going to be a good year for Brian and um, the INBA, PNBA and ABA um, as long as we all stick together and, and support the heart that puts these things on and the effort that put, goes into it and um, he has put the effort in and the time so I just want everyone to come out and show their support the same way that we've done for other promoters and other shows, um, and for myself. So I hope everyone does come out and support a great, great show that's gonna be put on. So I'm just excited Thank that, you, absolutely, I'm just excited to find someone who just is all about the athlete, because absolutely. that's that's all I've wanted is, it. it's it hard, is. It it's is. hard, it it's is. hard to compete, yeah. and I just want these competitors to be loved and taken care of and respected and their efforts appreciated, because they only get 30 seconds on stage. I want them to be respected from start to finish, not just that 30 seconds on stage, because they work really hard for it. And you being an athlete, Absolutely. you being an athlete, I don't doubt that happening. So that's really exciting. So I'll hand this one over to KP for next. Yeah, now, I'm, I'm really excited about the uniqueness of a Sunday show, because uh, like I think that's so original. And you know, the people, that are coming off because you know we have the OCB, the Cal Spring Naturals, and that's going to be a Saturday show. So anybody that's still within that arena, where you know, because some people have, like like Kimmy was saying, time is everything, and some people peak and some people don't peak when they should, and they're like, well, man, just one more week and I would have been there, and then I only have a week, but have a week and a day to actually step in and say, well, April 27th is right there. I might as well go ahead and step on stage then because I was so close. If I can maintain one more week. Now's my chance to win it. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, yep. That it. It was a. I think a blessing in disguise. To be honest with you. Uh, the venue ended up being taken the Saturday before, so we moved it to Sunday to keep the same weekend, so we wouldn't interfere and, and disrespect any other leagues. And mm -hmm. just wanted to make something available for us. And because of that, we know most people are off. Uh, it's yeah. a real unique way to stand out. And because it's a Sunday show, we're, we have changed the times, so we're not there so late. And you know, the times. The times have changed. So we have 10 a.m. prejudging, 4 p.m. night show, mm -hmm. which, in all honesty, could be done by 7-ish. You know, I yeah. mean, it's, it's really, it doesn't, it's not going to be a 10, 11, midnight, you know, that type of show. We can't have that. So, yeah. you know, everybody has to get back and get situated. Exactly. So it'll start earlier. It means there's not as much time in between. Uh, it'd be a little bit easier for the athletes to control things. Mm -hmm. and, and being close to home. Yeah, close to home, you're right here. So uh, it's going to be a way to say, well, maybe Sunday is a better day. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm really going to it's see a little <laughs> It's been more interesting to say, yeah. like, what if? So that's yeah. why we kept it. We're like, why not? Why you know, why not? I, I think that's original and it's unique. Yeah. And it might catch on. Because like I said, with, with travel, there's no guarantee about travel time, traffic, and all these other things. So it's always nice to have an, a, another opportunity, another way to look at things. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, so we're going to roll the dice on it and uh, see how it goes. All right. Well, you know, you've got another show in July that, that uh, it, it, because we, <laughs> like I said, for this region, I, I just love the fact that there's more shows. <laughs> and, you know, and, and then Ed and Andrea have taken on uh, an Iowa show, and you're going to be guest posing at your July show? Yes, sir. Yes, and so you're already pretty much uh, <laughs> dialing it in right now. So I'm, I, you, people, you can see the man takes it serious because, you know, this July is what? Another yeah, about another 12 weeks or so. Yeah, yeah. So it's you're, you're time to throw it on. Yeah, so you've really been uh, dialing it in nice now where you could actually step on stage and compete. 
<laughs> so I, I, I'm loving this. I, I'm loving it. I, I really wanted to meet you. I really wanted the Midwest to meet you. Because, you know, it's like, okay, this, this show is Illinois State. It sounds familiar. But who's this guy? I don't want people saying, who's this guy right when they get to the venue and realize, you know, oh, did we make a mistake in that? Because the last thing you want, like you said, for a competitor to be in doubt. Sure. The, you want them, and, and Kimmy has always stressed this, I want you feeling like you're welcome, like you're home. Yes. So when you step on stage, you're at home. Because you're honestly, yeah. yes, it, you, you, you don't have that arena, that, that feeling like you're out of place. Because right. there's nothing worse than walking into something and realize you stepped in a big pile of dookie. Right. You know, and, and who wants that? And, you know, it's nice to meet the guy before you meet the guy. Sure. Yeah. And so right back at you. Yeah, we're going to touch <laughs> we're gonna touch some weights and uh, get some stuff going, and we'll chat in a little bit after we get a nice little sweat going. But Midwest, East Coast, West Coast, PNBA family, natural competitors alike, this is Brian. This is Kimmy. You know Kimmy. If you don't know Kimmy, then you don't know the Midwest. So let's just be honest. Kayla Pratt, if you don't know me, you ain't been watching that. <laughs> Midwest muscle. We are out.